Unit number one. You must have a ticket. Compounds, some, any, and no. Guys, if you are here and you are watching this video, today we're, you're gonna learn how to use some, any, and no. Here we have this chart with the following words. Person, that is going to be represented by one or body, thing, and place, that is going to be represented by where, right? But also we have some, any, and no. And if we put these words together, we're going to acquire a new word. Look at this. Some. We have some, and with person, it is going to be someone or somebody. With thing, it's going to be something. With place, remember, it's represented by where, somewhere. We have any, any with person, that is represented by one or body, it's going to be anyone or anybody. We think anything and place or where, anywhere. No, with person it's going to be no one or nobody. We think nothing and place nowhere. Okay? Look at this chart. We use the compounds of some in affirmative sentence, of any in a negative sentence and, que and questions, and no with the affirmative form of the verb, right? So, some with affirmative sentences, any with negative and questions, and no with uh, affirmative sentences that has that have a negative meaning, right? Guys, if you're feeling confused, don't worry because now we're going to practice. Okay? Complete the sentences with compounds of some, any, or no. Please read the sentences and try to understand the context of them. Okay? Let's see. In the first sentence, the context is referred to a thing, and it's an affirmative sentence with a negative meaning. So we have to use no. And thing is going to be nothing. Right? In the second sentence, here, the context is related to a place. And it's an affirmative sentence. So we are going to use some where. And finally, in number three, the context is related to a place or where. But this sentence is affirmative with a negative meaning. So we have to use no. And no plus where it's gonna be nowhere. There's nothing to it. Let's order a takeout. Let's go somewhere exciting on the weekend. This is the end of the street. There is nowhere left for us to go. Okay? So these were just some examples. And with this set with sentence number four, five, six, and seven, these we're going to practice in classes. So, see you there.